Hey everyone, thanks for clicking on this video. My name is Chance, and today we're here for a reaction to Netflix's The Babysitter from 2017. Now, it's quite funny because I've honestly been really wanting to see this one since I think it came out. I love Samara Weaving, and I will watch her in anything she's in, and I heard this is supposed to be like, I think it's supposed to be campy. I think it's a campy horror movie, but other than that, I really don't know anything about this. It's titled The Babysitter, and it's a horror movie, so I'm assuming that maybe The Babysitter is like a killer trying to kill the baby, or the child whoever she's babysitting i don't know all i know is i get to watch smart weaving in another movie so i'm excited to check this out but if you are new here i do react to any and everything all horror so if that sounds like something we'd be interested in definitely go ahead and subscribe and then make sure the notification bell as well that way you can be notified anytime i upload and one last thing before we get into the reaction just a huge shout out to my youtube members can't stress it enough but you guys are the reason that i'm able to do as much content as i do and keep this channel going so i just want to say thank you so much if anyone else wants to be a part of that i'll make sure to leave the link in the description below all right but with all that out of the way let's go ahead and hop into the reaction for the baby Babysitter. I don't need it, I'm telling you. Oh, just because you don't feel sick right now doesn't mean you don't need the shot. There's a flu shot. Why are you giving me shit today? I mean, it's just the needle, man. He's got needle phobia. I'm not scared. <laughs> Is it a fear of blood or needles? <laughs> Damn. <Pussy. laughs> Damn, that's how it is? Cindy? How's it hang? Is Cindy? Or are they no, still the okay. bike? Right, well, speaking of hanging, have your balls dropped yet? <laughs> Not the two fucking hype men. Because on Saturday, I hooked up with Shelly McIntyre. I don't believe you. You don't need to believe him. It's not like you're believing him will value what happens to his dick. <laughs> what? As a 14 year old in that kind of situation with a 16 year old that looks like Shelly McIntyre, it was overwhelming, man. Why are you telling me this? Can you just bully me and then leave? Just said it didn't matter if I believed you. I changed my mind, bitch. Sorry, it was. I like the editing in this movie. Very creative. Ooh, ooh, hey! Jeremy, check it out. You so much as think about Cole again? It's about to fuck him up. The boys wanna be her. The girls wanna be her. The boys wanna be her. You crazy bitch. <laughs> What'd she say? I wanna know. Now get out of here! Run you over, you little pap smear. <laughs> you little pap smear. You skin your palms? Doesn't hurt. Yeah, it does. Come here. Oh, she's nice. She might be a murderer. I don't know. But I like her. You gotta punch him in the dick. Drop like a bag of rocks, and then when they trip over you and they're on the ground, kick him in the dick. Right in the dick. We get to hang out? Hang around, I get paid. I'm like your little <laughs> Protestant. Are you trying to say prostitute? I was wondering what he was saying. I'm like, damn, you know some big words. I don't even know what that word means. <laughs> Besides, I want to hang out with you either way. Really? Best babysitter ever. Hottest, too. Hey, is that the roof of your treehouse? Yeah, we just started to take it down. Treehouses are for kids anyway. Super 80s vibes with the um score. All right, tomorrow night, you, me, party. <laughs> they have a cute relationship. Fucking dad. He's gonna die in this movie, right? Hopefully. Cole, can you hand me one of those traps, please? Oh. Thanks. Hi. Oh, she's in this? Do you think I'm a pussy mom? <laughs> Honey, do you know what that word means? Yeah, like afraid of everything. <laughs> a lot of things are scary, but as you get older, those same things will stop frightening you as much. So I'm a pussy? How are those mirrors looking? Oh, oh this guy. Breaks. I don't remember what I recognize him from, but I recognize him from something. Seven teenagers die a day from driving. Really? Did you know that uh, 14 teenagers die a day from over worrying? <laughs> you started the car, you put the seatbelt on. Don't worry about it, pal. There's no rush. It's okay to be scared. His parents seem nice. I'm feeling like a cop. I'm craving some donuts. Hey. Oh. He's talking about donuts. I thought I meant like donuts, donuts, because that does sound good. Cole, will you clean up the toys in the hallway for me? Mm, much cleaner. <laughs> oh, why do I get a bad feeling about that? That shot of it right there, that car right next to the railing. 
Somebody gonna get fucked up. Hey, that doesn't seem safe at all. I'm gonna switch the roof with the fastbacks. That's more aerodynamic. Uh -huh. That's also gonna give me more downforce on the turns. Nice. I get exactly what you mean. Only use this if you're cutting a flank stake. And don't do that because or that's stabbing my job. a person. You take that job. What am I doing at this house? <laughs> my parents are going away again. I think they go to have sex, but it just makes me feel like they go to get away from me. <laughs> I bet B has boys over at your place all the time doing it. No, nope, no. That's what babysitters do. That's every babysitter. Have you ever been awake after she's fallen asleep? I dare you to stay up tonight. You'll see. I have a feeling she's going to be doing a lot more <laughs> than a booty call. I still don't have a grasp on like everything seems fine. But, like this movie seems really wholesome but it's a horror movie and i'm pretty sure it's rated r and i know it's gonna have a turn i just don't know what or when is she baiting this guy with the glasses she's gonna kill this boy tonight ain't she <laughs> why are you always getting hit in the head with a ball same guy anyway you know the drill no violent movies no junk food bed by ten no violent movies hey uh b call us if there's any trouble okay cole don't cause any trouble dad i know what if his parents are actually killers and they go out of town a lot to murder oh they'd be having fun why could not i get a babysitter like this this kid's gonna have a thing for blondes for the rest of his life i'm just saying Oh, that's cool. So special, so popular. Honestly, this kid lives the best. I mean, aside from being bullied, he's got the best life. <laughs> what movie is it? I bet they had so much fun making this movie. I think my parents are going to get a divorce. Melanie's parents got divorced. Now her mom lives with her boyfriend. That's gross. <laughs> but you know what? You'll be all right if your parents break up. I mean, you just gotta take care of yourself. It happens. Ah, shit, dude. It's super late. <laughs> I'm not tired. Well, I know you're not. I am. If I give you a shot, will you go to bed? I'll make it a double. Has she given him shots before? Now, remember, you don't say a word of this to your parents. My dad lets me drink Mike's all the time. <laughs> Mike's hard lemonade. You're not gonna do it with me? All right, sure. I'll be right back. I like, like, the score intensifying in parallel to his anxiety with the moment. Like, oh, I drank it already. Why don't you do it without me? Because he wants to be able to try and stay up tonight. Is that why? It's actually kind of pervy though. Why do people do it? I'm not a perv. I just want to know what happens after I go to sleep. Don't say it so loud. Why am I whispering? You need anything? All right, B, thanks for knowing me and treating me like I was okay. Oh, she is literally the best babysitter. I want to feel normal, but just feel weird most of the time oh well i like weird all of the time weird is more fun see you in the morning good night dave am i watching the wrong babysitter movie maybe this is just like a wholesome comedy i could just watch a movie of these you know these two for an hour and 20 minutes just do it how many people is it is this one person if it's multiple people, I might be scared. It might be some cult shit. Spin the bottle. Hey, he looked familiar. Oh, <laughs> I forget his name, but I know that actor. I know her too. Damn, all these actors are familiar. That was a cool way of editing, introducing the characters. Truth or dare? Dare. I dare you to kiss everyone here. Damn, everybody. Oh! <laughs> I know it was you, Fredo. <laughs> was that Lord of the Rings? Was that Lord of the Rings? Throw this girl out the window. This <laughs> guy in the glasses is shitting bricks right now. Oh, okay. Well, Y'all rehearsed this. <laughs> Y'all rehearsed this. <laughs> YouTube, this is for educational purposes. Please don't flag this. I'm learning a lot right now. The, my audience is learning a lot right now. Wait, just give me... Give me a second to process that shit. You raised by Rick James? You gave her that romantic shit? You just gonna lick my face? <laughs> Better than nothing. I'd take it. She's Damn. so hot. Oh, <laughs> he, he gonna run? And you got this? I don't even really know you guys. Oh, he doesn't know any of them? It's not weird. 
So he's a stranger Close amongst all eyes. these people. Okay. What the fuck is going on? Not even here. Uh uh, I sent some fuckery about. What's about to happen? Okay. They about to kill this man. You didn't think that was gonna wake the kid up? Them loud ass screams? You're helping fulfill a great purpose, and all this. What's the purpose? I don't wanna. Okay. That shit leaking. That shit leaking. Wait, hold on, my shit ain't working. I think we're out of blood or something. Oh, gross. You wanna go platinum, John? Things can get messy when you make a deal with the devil. Now collect it. Yep, like I said, some cult shit. You look like Carrie, but black. Carrie would've been better if she was black. She would've been covered in Hennessy. <laughs> Hennessy. Alrighty, babes, let's get started before we head upstairs and get the blood of the innocent. What? No, I thought she was cool. Hi, my name is Cole Johnson. A, a guy oh, was just no. The address is a, a two, four, five, the five, betrayal. Five. Fuck. Now listen to me. It's important that you stay here. I gotta protect myself. Do not do that. No, 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 no. He said, I gotta prepare myself. I was fine with her doing this whole sacrifice shit and everything. As long as we were safe. I didn't expect her to be like, now we need the blood of the innocent. I thought it was going to be a thing like, oh, he sees them and the others want to kill him, but she wants to help him out type of situation. Want to hear us? With the amount of drugs I gave him? Hell no. Oh, Do you so have the she, needle? she drugged the drink. Oh, no. There is a faster way to get all that blood. Do you know what happens when you kill someone? They lose like all their Instagram followers. <laughs> what? No, they die. And then I'd have to find another innocent kid. And all of this only works if we get that top shelf pure shit. So how many times have they been doing this? Wouldn't your best bet just to be, just to stay in your room if they're not gonna do anything else to you tonight? Oh my God, she's there. Wait, what happened? Did she actually give him something the second time? Why is his shirt off? Sir? Why is he shirtless? That's what I would say. Because after I took your blood, I waited in the room because something fell off. And then you fainted. So, you know, your blood sugar is low. Eat the cookie. Oh. Uh. Why are you awake, Cole? I was gonna go smoke in the woods. You were gonna go smoke in the woods. You weren't gonna share with your boy? I don't know you. Because I don't like alcohol. I just drank it because I wanted you to think I was cool, so. Nice. <laughs> Bitches. Why is his shirt covered in blood? Because no one would let me borrow a shirt. Does he not even see the mirror behind him? We can see you cutting the rope. <laughs> Damn. I won't tell my parents that you guys were having an orgy and needed my blood to do it. <laughs> <laughs> this was clearly a misunderstanding. Sonia, untie him. I'm sorry we scared you, Cole. We good? Oh shit, that's right, he called the cops. Girl, you stop panicking. I mean, yeah, panic. Damn. Here we go. Jesus Christ. Black Lives Matter too. Damn. What the, for my handgun? You Mexican, right? Look, I speak Spanish. Lo siento, my nigga. Lo siento. <laughs> Jesus. What is this movie? Three out of four people got an STD. I got two people's blood on me. <laughs> you do the math. I got AIDS. I know I got AIDS. Officer Binek, what's your status? Just say all clear. Why would he know cop codes? Little boy, he a nerd. Hey, tell him the code. <laughs> Little boy, he a nerd. It's 10-4, obviously. Once we're taking a break to get food. Code seven. Damn, he knows all this shit. Ten four, all clear. We're code seven. <laughs> <laughs> this guy's insane. Oh, that's right. You got shot. Oh my god, he shot me in the boob. What kind of shit is a girl in the boob? Are you sure? I thought he shot you in the heart. It's only gonna stop growing. They weren't even done. Man, sometimes you gotta settle. I got a cousin Chantel. Titties flat. 
personality real good. <laughs> personality real good. I need an Amazon. I don't want to lose my boob. I can't do that. <laughs> Girl, you could lose your life. He's <laughs> gonna wanna suck on my nipples. This movie is wild. Hey, oh. Oh. oh! Oh my god! Get him. I got him. I'm gonna kill you with my bear. Hands. Well, is it gonna work no. now? Your plan since he technically killed somebody, so he's not innocent. Come on! You guys really have to let me know in the comments how um, part two is because this is amazing. I'm loving this so far. Hey, Coley. How's it heading? Oh, God. Just fucking drop. Max? It's okay, Max. <laughs> oh, fuck. Nobody else is hearing all this ruckus. Oh! Just say stop backing up without looking what's behind you. Bug spray and blanket and a drill. And a lighter. Okay, okay. We're cooking, we're cooking. What you got? What's that? Yes. Fat dragon. Let's do it. Hell yeah. Guy's not the smartest giving away his position as he's chasing you, so you know where he's coming from. Oh, that is a big fucking spider. Oh, there's one on his back. Oh, there's three. There's four. No, I didn't. I wasn't ready for spiders tonight. I, I would if I would have known. I would have prepared. He's gonna come down here. This is where you are. <laughs> yep. I feel like you're going to be set on fire. Good boy. <laughs> oh, it's a fucking spider. Ooh. Sonia, bring your cookies and help me find this little fox. I'm coming. There's some tense scenes in this movie. Something's about to happen. Don't see that. Oh. <laughs> Hi, Cole. Fuck. Do you think you'll take your parents? to find your body down here <laughs> oh she crazy kill her hit her with the fat dragon right in the face oh shit you miss nice <laughs> just lock her down there this girl talks a lot oh no that's going to cause a huge explosion. <laughs> Holy shit. Two-time murderer. What did that? A firework? A firework? Holy shit. <laughs> Damn, good for you, kid. She just loves murder. Yeah, where's my head start? Wait till they've almost got you dropped like a bag of rocks. Yes. Ugh. Him in the dick. Nice. Oh. Do it again. You missed my dick. No, I didn't. Is it that sure small? And I got a big dick. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell is that? <laughs> what? Eggs. You got shitting me. Oh, he's getting egged. Your house? Oh my god, this is gonna be amazing. Who's this kid? You egg your house a lot sometimes so what are you gonna do about it you're about to murder me what does it matter this is america you need to wreck his ass are you kidding me get out there and crush that bitch go <laughs> this guy's a psychopath i'm gonna take this right foot nice. and i'm gonna whop you on that side of your face i feel like this is gonna go wrong but i hope it doesn't i'm gonna wreck your ass <laughs> i told you Shit. There's a guy over there who's trying to kill me. I swear to God. I swear to God. I'm serious. I'm serious. There are dead <laughs> bodies in my house. Wait, seriously? Yeah, seriously? <laughs> Here's a plan. On three, we're gonna make a run for my bike. We're gonna ride in the back, all right? You're about to leave your ass. One, 
helped you. Damn. <laughs> Have fun getting murdered, colon cancer. Colon cancer. You can all let me go now? No. But if you kill me, you won't get what you want. I came here to kill people. <laughs> about to say, he's built different. Yes! That's what I'm talking about, Cole! Come on, buddy! <laughs> this guy is terrifying. Come on, Coley! I'm pretty sure that's Stephen Amell's brother. He's in a show called... I forgot the name of the show. It's like some futuristic show. Coley! Come down and play! We gotta find a way to murder this psychopath. <laughs> He looks like he could just climb this fucking tree. He? He's climbing the rope, probably. Behind you, kid. Oh shit, I knew it. Like fucking US Navy SEALs and shit. Where'd he go? Fucking ninja. Oh shit! Badass kid, Cole. Relax, man. <gasps> Is he gonna end up dying by accident? Don't worry, kid. I'm not gonna let you die with egg on your face. It's better than this. Oh, this is gonna come into play. His hands are gonna be slippery. He's gonna end up falling, isn't he? He's not gonna be able to hold on. Yep. <laughs> I totally called it. I knew it was gonna be a death by accident situation. Why are there guns? Why are there guns? What's that? Was that a gun? I got the two guys and the Asian girl, and the, the cheerleader girl got shot in the boobs, so I think it's just B. <laughs> got shot in the boobs. Y'all are making way too much noise. Ah, that was so close. Ooh, that was clutch. God damn. Thing is off center. Just don't, stop setting it right there. Do you have your phone? Yeah. Okay, call the cops. Tell them it's 1053. Why do you know cop codes? I used to want to be a cop when I grew up. I was wondering how he knew all the damn cop codes. I've had a really bad night. No. Oh. Uh, <laughs> the last face. guy I saw get kissed got stabbed in the head by two knives. Trauma. It's going to take a while to get over. I'm really excited we kissed. Me too. Let's make out next time. We have a life or death situation going on. I'm going towards my house! I'm right here, B! The hell's going on? She's about to wake up, ain't she? What the fuck is going on? Sacrifice. Get your dream. She crazy. I only signed up for this dumb shit. So I could have my dream job, but instead, what do I have now, huh? <laughs> no nipple. What kind of job do you want? I'm a journalist. See, that's perfect, because you're super smart and you're hot. She's falling for it. That's fucking hilarious. Exactly. Do you think I give a fuck what you're talking about? <laughs> <laughs> oh, run! I thought she was falling for it. Yes. Everything's coming back into play. What? Are you the one that put the knife in the dishwasher? <laughs> Shit. You. <laughs> that was fucking hilarious. Looking for this? You only got one butcher knife? You ruined my <laughs> life. I'm gonna ruin yours. <laughs> Damn. Found this in the cop car. That was so graphic. <laughs> She was so annoying. She really was, but she was funny too. Are you gonna shoot me? No. No, I was just shooting around you because I thought you put your hands up and shit, but I will burn your book. That might make things worse. We don't know what this book is. You mix the blood of the innocent with the blood of someone sacrificed. You get whatever you want. You just used me to get what you wanted. Oh. I mean, I could have shot you and not Allison, but I didn't. I chose you because you're the best. Choose me. It'd just be you and me against the whole world. No one will ever hurt you ever again. There'll be nothing left to be afraid of. Isn't that what you've always wanted? I go for it. <laughs> okay, let's do it. I guess I have a plan too. <laughs> There's that Samara weaving scream. And bad mistakes. Time to drive. The <laughs> There's no way. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs>
This kid is crazy. That was insane. This movie's fucking wild. <laughs> I'm an adult because when I realized you were the big bad, I drove a stolen car through you. <laughs> I see you see. Goodbye. Damn. Hit her with the goodbye. Didn't even do the finger thing with her. I thought you were going to drive away. I couldn't leave you. Oh, that was such a douche car. <laughs> Dude. Cole stole a car. Rammed his house. Killed like 50 people. <laughs> 50 people. 50 people. <laughs> Damn, Cindy. <laughs> Are you okay? Are you I'm okay? You all right? What happened? What? It's a long, well, I mean, not a long story, but it's a crazy fucking story. I don't need a babysitter anymore. True. Unless she looks like her. Gone. Oh, shit. So I know there's a part two. Is she in a part two or is it just the character and it's a different actress? Damn, now I want to know. Honestly, guys, that has to be probably one of my new favorite horror movies. If you aren't new here and you know me, I love campy horror movies, you know, horror comedies, but like horror comedies in the vein that where it's still very messed up. It can still have scary moments, you know, be gory. I don't like when they go full horror comedy. And I feel like they just nailed that here. They really had fun with this movie. I'm not sure exactly how long it was, but I think it was about 20, 25 minutes for the setup. I almost forgot I was watching a horror movie but i knew that eventually shit was gonna have to hit the fan but when it did i did not expect it to just go completely left like that and i wouldn't even say it was the moment that you know she stabbed the guy for the sacrifice once the cops came in and then the cheerleader the girl the cheerleader outfit whatever got shot and then the guy threw the thing like that's when i was like okay this movie's batshit crazy and i love it i thought everyone did perfect with the performances like especially um i believe his name is robbie ml i thought he was great as like the basically murderous jock going around just enjoying all the killing i thought the cheerleader was hilarious she did a good job playing her role and everyone else was just amazing as well like i said everyone did a really good job smart weaving very convincing as the nice cool babysitter to the you know when she switched up to this crazy murderous person who basically just wants you know she's gonna do whatever she can to get what she wants in life but yeah these are just my quick afterthoughts but i love this movie i really have to check out the sequel i can't remember what people said but i'm pretty sure there was people who said that it, you know it's not as good as the original i do know that smart weaving isn't in it so maybe that's you know part of the reason why but as long as they keep this tone and like you know they have this as much fun as they did with this one then i'm totally down to check it out so make sure you let me know in the comments below what you thought of it if you want me to check out the sequel um leave comments the more comments i see and more likes i see on those comments then i'll know you guys want me to do it and i'll try and make sure i do it next month for sure but if you enjoyed my reaction please go ahead and hit the like button don't forget to subscribe and then also hit the notification bell as well that way you can be notified anytime i upload but as always you guys have a wonderful day and i'll see you guys next time